Okay, y'all, so I am back, and so since I'm back, let me go ahead and do my intro. Welcome to my channel. I am Danielle, your lover, a partner, and cry. Oh my gosh, she's crying again. <laughs> and this is Relentless Beauty because we are what? In relentless pursuit of self-improvement. Now, I just fed her, y'all. Okay, take three. <laughs> so, yes, we are in my new home. We just bought our first house. I'm so excited. So I just wanted to say, hey, show y'all my little outfit of the day. Give y'all a house tour, an empty house tour, okay? We're here getting things set up. Like we had the security come in and that was installed. We're waiting on some furniture to be delivered. Um, the refrigerator, the appliances came in the house except for the refrigerator. Well, except for the refrigerator and washer and dryer but microwave dishwasher and stove came in the house so like i said we're waiting for furniture to be delivered we already had some furniture delivered like the bunk beds and that's been put together and it's set up we're still waiting on mattresses and stuff um but yeah so i'm gonna show you my outfit of the day and do an empty house tour so no makeup because i plan on cleaning and everything and no wig because okay i'm not trying to have a bunch of hair in my face and i'm not trying to sweat makeup off and stuff um so fresh face okay got my new little earrings on that i got from target this little faux leather jacket is from rainbow um this shirt, I do believe, is Express, but I got it from the thrift store, okay? Got my little low cut <laughs> so I can whip the boobs out, okay? I didn't like this shirt because it was so low cut when I first got it, but now it's perfect. Um, the jeans are Shein. And I got the boots from Gabe's and my purse is from Gabe's. So since we're in the bathroom and I've already, you've kind of seen some of it. <laughs> I guess I'll just show you, start here in the bathroom. So this is the nice little light fixture. And this is why I fell in love with this house. So we've been house hunting for not long, as a matter of fact. But when I saw this house, I was just wow. So, and it was like the fixtures and things. So, I love this light fixture. We got the nice double sinks, blue backsplash. Um, this is interesting. If you have this in your house, like, what do y'all do with that? Because <laughs> I'm just thinking, you know, like, I guess I might put. You know, my Q-tips and my toothbrush and toothpaste in here for convenience, but I really don't know what that's even called <laughs> or what it's for, but those are my plans for that. Um, I got shelves in the cabinet, as you can see. Things definitely need to be clean. I guess I ain't gonna open up all the cabinets. Oh, got some extra backsplash up in here. Okay, we got some extra paint and stuff too in this house. I ain't mad at it. So this is our floor, nice marble look to it. We got the closet here in the bathroom. Um, I'm thinking of doing shelves in here. Like shelves and rods, not just straight up rods. I'm just showing y'all a wall. <laughs> okay, let me not get too loud and the baby wake up. Um, I'm assuming these are towel hooks. Okay, I've lived in old houses for all of my life. So these modern features, y'all have to help me out and let me know what are these modern features. Okay, we definitely know <laughs> that this is a towel rack. Well, look at my shower. I'm telling you, it's the features. This is why I was wild. So we got the rain shower head and this fancy schmancy faucet, well, knob, shower knob, whatever. Um, oh, I do love how 
The organization is basically built in, so I really can't see myself buying or needing to buy anything for um, organization because it's got the little shelves and things already. Oh, we got this type of toilet, which is completely new for me to have a little button to flush. So there's the baby Empress. Um, we gotta get screens for the windows. But, oh, we got the, what, the barn door is called. So we got the barn door. Oh, she's getting fussy to the master bedroom. Uh, I might have to continue the tour. Let's pause. Okay, so I am back with the tour. Had to feed little Miss Empress. So this is our laundry room. Y'all bear with me, okay? I am not a videographer anymore. Like I said, we got some of the paint cans. Um, oh, let's see, let's, let's do this. We got nice high ceilings, recessed lighting, and look at this. I just discovered this. So you can bring it all the way down. I'm not gonna do this one handed and mess something up, but you can bring these lights all the way down. I don't know how high up they can go, but you can see how you can push it up. Well, I ain't gonna be able to do that one either. But yeah, nice door right here, letting in plenty of light. You can see the little security thing up there. Um, yeah, we do have the water hookup. So, um, I honestly, the refrigerator that we're getting is a gift from my mother-in-law. So, I don't even know what type of refrigerator it is, whether it's got the ice maker or what have you. But either way, um, we have the hookup for it if it is. So, at the cabinet, subway tile, stainless steel appliances. I know some people don't like stainless steel. I love stainless steel because to me, it's just, it's easier to clean. I know some other, other people think like it's a pain to clean, but to me, it's not. Like white shows every little bit of dirt. I don't mind black. I know some people are like, mm -mm. and I know y'all wondering, why are you focused on this? Cause this is neat. Look y'all. Lazy Susan. Okay, it's filthy. That's why I need to clean. But we got the Lazy Susan in here. And this is new. I have never seen um, cabinets like that. But yeah. So this is that's the master bedroom that I just came out of. That's my nice little security system over there with the camera and all of that jazz. Me and my husband were playing with that. So this is one of the kids' rooms. We're putting triple bunk beds in here. Y'all bear with me. <laughs> I gotta back up. I'm in the closet now. <laughs> so, um, yeah, we're gonna put triple bunk beds in here. Tw um, there's twins on top and a full on the bottom. It's a nice wood floors. Oh. Here's the guest slash kids bathroom no they don't have the fancy shower here like I got but they still have a nice shower here super nice I would say judge about all these little whatchamacallers shoot we're gonna see what these sevens are um uh, nice lighting <laughs> um and these are the cabinets they are working with. And then the 
got my husband and my next youngest son. They put the bunk beds together. So, yeah. Oh, I ain't shit out of closets. But none of the closets have. Is there a light in the closet? No, there's no light in their closet. There's a light in my closet. Our closet. My closet. <laughs> but none of the closets have um, shelves or rods in them. So we're going to have to do that. We've got a nice covered porch. Which I love. But yeah. Oh, the neighbors, they came over. Is this, they coming for us? No. The neighbors in that house that the truck is sitting in front of them, they came over to say, hey, and welcome us to the neighborhood. Now these churches, I don't think are open because we came, when we did the open house for this, or the tour, because it wasn't an open house. When we did the tour, nobody was at those churches and the other churches were booming. So I don't think these churches are open, but maybe they are, and maybe they worship on a different day other than Sunday, I don't know. But nice quiet street from what I can see. Oh, we got the sidewalk going all around. They did fix the cracks in the sidewalks for us before we moved. We got nice little hedges and a flower bed and everything. My husband's talking about um, screening in the front porch. And I told him I do want like railings because for safety reasons, like I'm not trying to twist my ankle, not paying attention and walk off the damn porch. Cause I will do some shit like that. <laughs> but yeah. Oh, let me cut the light off. In here. Y'all hear the security system. So yeah, I am super pleased. I am super pleased that we are in our first home. It is nice. Like I said, out of all the houses that we um, looked at, my bun is plucking my nerve because it's like, it's crooked, but whatever. I was awakened at 6.30 this morning to get ready to come here. Um, and I'm breastfeeding exclusively so if you breastfeed you know how that goes she was cluster feeding of the earlier this week so <laughs> you know and that's why she was getting fussy too well she's not cluster feeding right now thankfully I've been, so i've been able to catch up on my rest but um i just went to sleep maybe like four or something from feeding her but she took a pretty long nap because the ride over here was about 30 or so minutes from where we are right now. And she took a pretty long nap. She slept through the installation, even though he was drilling and doing all his stuff. He's in, in dropping shit. So I'm sorry. <laughs> like it's fine. She's sleeping like a baby, pun intended. So when she woke up though, I had already fed her both boobs. And she was content and falling asleep. And that's when I decided, okay, well, let me do my video. But she wanted some more. So, yeah, that's why she was fussy. And now she's in there with her brother. It's his birthday. He's officially a teenager today. So I've got all teenagers, except for my youngest, who's eight. My youngest, he's my youngest mama, except for my youngest son who is eight, and now my baby girl. Finally got my girl. So yeah, um, I'm super excited. So like I was saying, this was the best house out of the ones we saw. Um, as far as like, it checked a lot of the marks. Yeah, I did want, I, I did want like a brick house. I would prefer new construction, but out of the new construction houses, this house, as far as the features and everything looked better. It, the new, new construction was just bigger and, you know, it was new. It was two-story. 
but they won't even break. And then one of the new constructions I saw, like it was nice, it was in our price range and everything, but the neighborhood was like weird. Like all of the houses looked exactly the same, everything like, and then they had the nerve to have an aerial view, which didn't, which didn't help their cause. It's like the whole neighborhood, everything looks the same. Like I don't like cookie cut shit. So um, this house has character. Um, if you go on my community post page, you'll see the outside. That was a picture that is a picture that our realtor gave to us, you know, as a, you know, welcome present. Welcome to your new home. And he gave us a card and everything. The process was really easy. I know people was like, you know, buying a house is a nightmare. He made the process super easy, super simple um, and stress-free, you know, with the bat for us because they weren't trying to give us this house at first. Okay, now if you go on to my other channel, which I haven't done that video yet, and I don't know when I am, <laughs> I'll tell you, uh, on a spiritual level, what that was all about, and um, how that worked out in our favor. But what I can say is we got some money back on closing. <laughs> How's that? Um, as a matter of fact, oh, we don't have a mailbox. We need a mailbox for that check coming in the mail, bag maybe. So, um, yeah, but out of the houses we saw, this just wild, you know, like walking in, the high ceilings, the fixtures, the details, the colors, the barn door, you know, we did go into another house that was really nice, hold up. <laughs> and it had a Lazy Susan as well, so I'm like, oh. And then this one does, but anyway. The baby's calling, so I had to talk to y'all another time. Y'all have to make sure you subscribe and hit the notification bell so you can see how I decorate this place and come shopping with me and all that jazz. Okay, so it's been a long day. We have been here since, I don't know, a quarter to eight and it's almost eight o'clock. <laughs> So I got a lot accomplished though. So I'm gonna show you what I did today. So we got a refrigerator. Yes, it's scratch and dent, but <laughs> we got a good deal on it. So I'm not mad. We just put this up for privacy because we still need to get blinds and curtains and stuff. Okay, edited Danielle here. <laughs> so I told y'all in the video well, let me show y'all all that I did today. And then I didn't tell you what I did. Okay, so, um, clean all of those cabinets, clean the refrigerators, the, all the appliances and stuff, swept, clean the bathrooms, um, partially, because I still need to go through the cabinets and drawers and things and clean them out. And then, you know, putting some stuff up, washing dishes and things and putting them away so that's <laughs> what i did oh and i had the kids go outside because um that house was built in 1920 but as you can see it's been modernized and so it was a lot of glass and different things on the ground outside so i had the kids you know go and pick all of that stuff up so we got a good amount accomplished for the day so <laughs> back to the regularly scheduled video now these curtains are to stay let me cut the light on because they're really pretty so these are really pretty these are the curtains and they come with tie backs i've been putting in plug-ins so getting the house smelling nice this is the living room suit that came today. Super nice. I'm super surprised at the ottoman. Like the ottoman is huge and it's sturdy like a table. So I'm thinking, you know, like I'm gonna put a tray up there um, and I'm sprucing up as I talk. So excuse the, uh, the camera work. Oh, my husband just got this clock and <laughs> brought that home. Um, So yeah, I gotta get used to this dishwasher. I, I probably won't be using it that much. First of all, um, anybody trying to have a high ass water bill. So that's number one. 
Number two, I'm, I wash dishes by hand. So my mother-in-law, she helped us out a lot. Like she bought the living room suit for us and the refrigerator. She picked up some little stuff for the house like this and the, the towels, like the towels, some pots and pans. Came from the thrift store, not hurt at all. Um, matter of fact, I can show you like that crock pot down there, which isn't hurt at all. It's $10, 10 or $15. Um, those pots, my husband bought those frying pans. Those are new. Um, that pot was like $10. Um, that baking sheet, I'm not sure how much that was, but it wasn't much. But thrift store finds. Picked up some little stuff, you know, that we need for the house. Bag clips for chips. Um, got a trash can. Got some paper towels and stuff. Got some more pillows. We got our internet hooked up. Here's little Miss Empress. Um, let's see. Well, we tried to, well, I tried to put the shower curtains up in our bathroom, but the shower rod is not secure at all. We need another shower rod. But this shower rod is secure. My son, he picked out these shower curtains for our bathroom, but it does not match at all, but it matches their bathroom <laughs> perfectly with the gray. Um, you know how we do over here. Well, I don't know why there's so many paper towels right here. Got a little step stool because I'm too short to clean the cabinets, and even that step stool is still a little short, but I worked it out. We got this, but we haven't put them up yet. So yeah, still got a lot more to do, but everything is coming together. So, so y'all can see my pretty face. I'm super tired. Who knows whether I'll be able to take a nap because the baby has been knocked out for a while. So probably by the time we get home, she can be up and ready to go. So we'll see, it's gonna be one of them days. And then we gotta come back tomorrow and get some more stuff done. But anyway, that is it y'all. Thank you for watching the video. Stay tuned for more and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.